Bim, guess what? We're back, we're live, and it's Retro Gaming Club again. Uh, today we are going to be playing uh, some snart, uh, snart, some snares cartridges. Snares, snart, combine the two, see what you get. Um, we've got six cartridges that have been traded in actually today, um, so I thought uh, I would test them uh, tonight, because let's be honest, there's not a lot else you can do. So we've got less than an hour to do this. So uh, let's start, shall we? So first off, we've got a game called uh, Flashback, which was the follow-up to Another World. Um, and then I think in turn had a follow-up as well. It's cheap enough, it's only uh, 6 95 So we'll stick it in, turn it on and see if we get action straight away. The answer is nope. Retro on it, yep, that's right, that's right, that's right. Okay, we've got everything set up. Hi, JT. Ah, we're off, we're off, we're off, we're off, we're off. So, Delphine Software um, and Flashback it is. Let's check something before I go any further. Ah, okay, right. Right. What am I doing? No, I don't want to do that. Because it's telling you the story, isn't it? What happened and how you ended up where you are. I think basically this is the guy escaping from the uh, old one. Hi Rachel as well. From flashback. I think their uh, machine's bigger than his machine. Uh oh. I think they shot at him down. So, let to play. But we're not dead. There we go. Always go backwards because you never know what you're going to find. Right, can we run? It's been that long since I played this, I can't remember. What we can actually do or not do. Now these games are just impossible. They're so solid. It's untrue. Hollow cube. I'll take that. Right. Nothing else there. No. Is that a lever we can pull or do something with? Oh, we can run. Can we jump though? Oh, we can jump, right, there we go. You press up to jump. Right. Right, there we go. Jump back up there. Holy cube. Can we do anything with holy cube? No. Okay. Oh. Ooh. 
rep. Hey, it's me in the holocube. Hi, comrade. You must be wondering now how you recorded this message without remembering it. Good question, but it would take too long to explain. The time is short, and if you want to save your hide, you must contact your old friend Ian in Washington, in New Washington. He'll explain it all there. Uh, good luck, and watch your back because it's uh, something or other. Right, okay. All right, okay. Sorry. Alright, okay, we can escape that. Right. So we need to jump up. There we go. Right, can we jump up there? Yeah. Can we jump up there? Or is that wood in the way? No, we can jump up there. Excellent. Right, we can run. So let's run. Let's right, stop run. <laughs> Just remembered. Hello? There was one down there as well. Right, put your gun away. How do we fire the gun? Right. Okay, put your gun away. Get up there. Turn around. Crouch down. Get your gun out. Crouch down. Alright, okay. Right, so I shot it, but the explosion nearly killed me. Brilliant. Just joined us, we're testing, well, I'm testing cartridges on a Super Nintendo. Oh, what? And the game we're currently playing is Flashback. Which is one of the hardest games in the world. and then let's move forwards a little bit and see if we can go a bit further without dropping off no we can't, ok uh, oh. <laughs> right, there's nothing I can do there so I'll jump up there jump up there <laughs> come on we can do this thank you I mean this I played this game on the Amiga I'm sure I did I certainly played another world on the Amiga anyway and uh, that was solid Oh, we can go behind there. I don't know if we could go behind there. We can't go any further, though. I assume they were stopping you walking. I didn't, I didn't see the perspective. Anyway, it was on the Amiga, yeah, there you go, John. And it is a pain. It was a pain. It is a pain. 
But we've got six games to get through, and some of them I want to play a little bit longer than that. So, we'll say goodbye to Flashback. we get a nice Flashback with Flashback. And next up, we will play... Uh, Let's go for my least favourite game of the lot, which may cause some consternation. £7.95, and it is Mortal Kombat. Always... Hated Mortal Kombat. Even in the arcade, I hated it. I just thought it was a terribly bad game. Right. Okay. Uh oh. That's so we got a problem. To be fair, this game looks like it's been played loads. Might even be worn out. You never know though. Right. Regular viewers will know that uh, my unofficial sponsor is Windeline. So, square, turn a bit of Windeline on the desk. Get myself a cotton bud, which I've just dropped on the floor, so get myself another cotton bud. Ta da! And get it a little bit moist and damp, and then just rub along the teeth. Oh, yeah! And you'll see. Oh, my God. You'll see how dirty it was. That was a fresh cotton bud. Further back ago, the dirtier it is. So yeah, that might be why it wasn't playing. So. Ta -da! There we go. Always dry it afterwards, obviously. Dreadful game, dreadful game. Developed by Sculptured Software. I wonder what they turned up. Turned into Midway, wasn't it? Midway did not come back last. Yeah, Midway then. Uh, tournament, just go for tournament. We'll just do one fight and then we'll move on. Uh, I know him. I don't know his name, but I know him. Right, Scorpion, there you go. I knew, I knew, I knew him. He can do stuff, can he? Whoa. Oi. I'm Scorpion. Ah, oh, close, though. Johnny Cage wins. How does he keep his sunglasses from breaking? Uh, no, John, I am not interested in the new film. I'm surprised to you. That's as much of that game as I'm going to play. I know, you're shocked. But there you go. Took me longer to get it going than when I actually played it. But that's because I've got a game coming up now that I know very little about. Other than, again, it was 100% on the Amiga. It was also on the PC um, and a few other games consoles as well. Uh, there was a remake a few years ago. Uh, of it um, but it was nothing like the original game because the original game for what I can remember was like a um, hexagonal strategy game although I could be completely wrong whereas the updated version was like a first person CPU where you could see through walls and jump down things and you're in a building you had to escape the building and all that kind of stuff but this version is by Bullfrog distributed by Ocean um, and it's from uh, 1994 Although it did come out in 1991 originally. 
and it is possibly named after one of my well one of my least favorite youtubers apart from when he did the i'll show you um whatever it was um the bob wall bob 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 um um, console abuse, that was it, when he got banned off uh, Xbox. It is. Syndicate. It's a game I've never played. Hence my vagueness at uh, what the game is. For I haven't got a clue. Now this has come from the same place as Mortal Kombat, the same person. So I'm just going to give it a quick, quick wipe. So I can see Muck already on it. You can see that or not, yeah. It's a bit it's a bit on the grubby side. Not to worry. <laughs> the good old days of gaming, no twelve gigabyte downloads, yes, exactly. You bought the cartridge, and that was it. Off you go. I've told this story many times, but I worked in a shop where we imported games from Japan. We had a uh, delivery, well, it wasn't delivery, I had to go to, from Manchester City Centre, I had to go to Oldham to pick it up from the distribution centre. And it had one copy sealed, obviously, because it was near the Super Famicom version of Star Wars. Um, got back to the shop, Christmas Eve, the guy comes up, he was massive, um, and he said, uh, what's in the box? I said, I'll just pick it up and blah, 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 and, you know, pulled out this Star Wars game. And he went, uh, I'll buy it. And I'm like, well, you know how much it is? It's real expensive. He said, someone will buy it. And I think it was 130 quid, because I had to be trained fair onto it as well. And um, that was only a couple of quid. So he said, yeah, yeah, so he gives me the money, off he goes. You made my son's Christmas, he'll be very happy, blah, 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 and off he, off he goes. Okay, fair enough. Never thought anything about it again until uh, uh, about Easter, and I'm reading a magazine, and it said in Japan the uh, Star Wars game had been recalled because when they were game testing it, and game testers on it, they had a bit where you're driving around in the hovercar thing, and you had to go over a bridge to a canyon to get to the next level and what they've done is they took the bridge out so that the play testers could only mess around in the bit where the, the vehicle was um, but they forgot to put the bridge back in when they released the game in England and all the rest of the world they'd already started the problem but the early copies of that game you couldn't get any further than the hovercar thing uh, and I was like well that guy never come back because I remember selling the game I'm like that guy never come back so um, is it a case of a, we got a later copy, so it was alright, or is it a case of B, uh, the kid he bought it for was that rubbish at playing games, or didn't like it, he never got to that bit, or is it C, he did realise the fault and thought this might be worth hundreds of pounds in years to come. Either way, never ever came back. Anyway, I can't imagine I'm going to play this game for long looking at the demo. Uh, practice more than it? it's a good idea. I can't even. Pr I, I can't, pff, I'm that stupid at this game. I can't even press the, uh, the practice more thing on it. They can just release a day one update. You can't do it on a cartridge. Not in 1991. Right. Okay. Follow me, guys. Right, okay, that's how you follow me. Pick that up, pick the money up. Pick the money up, come on. How do I pick the money up? I don't know. Do I do get a better guns? Bizarre game, isn't it? Right, we can't go through the wall. There's another agent there, though. So now behind a wall. 
Be a bad day, it's a bad day. game I was expecting. This is not the game you were expecting. That's what we were saying, um, MA Iraq. Um, you've got the joy now of people releasing games that are not complete. Whereas back then, seek up. To kill one of my guys? No. All oh, right. Right, I'm running out of ammo here. I need to figure out how to pick stuff up. Music's very uh, dramatic, isn't it? Very nineties. Very Terminator. The the look of them as well, with the air cut and everything. Again, a bit Terminator. Right, I'm going to press that one, that doesn't do anything, 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 press that one, doesn't do anything, press that one, doesn't do anything. So I'm going to run out of, I've run out of ammo. Have they run out of ammo as well? I don't know I did that, but I can change my character. Where have the guns gone? Where have the guns gone? This is not going well. I can tell that because it's going very badly. Right, we've got our guns back. Why can't we reload our guns? Well, the main man's dead. shoot them once. This is a bizarre game. You can drive cars. Uh, yeah, very. there was a lot more games. Uh, I mean, I had on the Mega Drive, I had um, uh, uh, Rainbow Island, uh, Japanese. And I also had, um, oh, what the hell was it called? Um, I've still got it, New Zealand Story Japanese as well. Alright, here we go, this is how we get around. The guns look the same. Quite a big city, isn't it? This is Zelda in the future, isn't it? I was having a fight in a building where I couldn't see a thing. <laughs> that's 
that's that's 8 and 16 bit gaming you can't even see your in character because he's inside a in building that you can't even see inside of because they didn't have the memory to show you the inside of the building oh I love it um, oh you split co-op with two controls that probably makes more sense than what I was doing anyway uh, we're uh, 25 minutes in we've still got a few games to go yeah so next up use the radar next up you tell me that when I'm dead is um, oh I didn't say how much it was syndicate you think it'd be dear wouldn't you it's only 9.95 not bad at all so next up is the classic that most people say is the best game on the console and they're wrong of course but they do they say it's the best game on the console uh, it's been around forever it did appear uh, on the Commodore 64 um, and the uh, Spectrum and the Amstrad um, well not this version but the first version of it did uh, and it's still going to this very day and I only found out recently in 2016 that it's not just a fighting game there's actual storylines to it like in the last one that came out in 2016 one of the characters had gone to Tekken world to do something in Tekken so it wasn't in the, the number five of this game I'm like what and that's because he was avenging someone who uh, anyway 1095 will get you this game <laughs> please know prices are correct at time of broadcast it's still a bit wet that one so I need to uh, get a dry cotton bud and dry it off a little bit Do you know what it is yet? Oh, inappropriate, sorry. It is Street Fighter 2. Not Turbo, not anything, just Street Fighter 2. This is the one I had, again, Japanese. Um, talking about games that didn't come out in the UK, you've also got games like Parodius, and then there were loads of strategy games as well, weren't there, that the uh, Japanese loved that we were a bit like, nah, you're all right. So, be Ryu, Honda, Chun Li, Ken. Don't really, oh, is it, no, I don't know who it was. He's gone. Blanca, Chun Li. Oh, the Chun Li. Oh, we're going to Japan. Japan. That's not where Japan is. Oh, we're against Ryu. Never liked Ryu. I always thought he was a bit up himself, to be fair. Oh, fight. Oi! Fighting a girl here. Behave yourself. Oh, maybe angry now. Oh, you may be very angry. There you go. What's that? It was. Oh, he brought the scenery. So, look, more destruction on this game than what there is in Call of Duty. Yeah. To this day. Round two. Fight. Fight. You can't do blocking all the time. More destruction. Oh no! Uh oh! Oh no! Oh no! I'm not angry, I'm just decimated. Picking on a gear. Round three, fight! Whoa! That's not very nice. Oh no! No! 
Oh, he got me with a hurricane. There you go, destruction. Come on, I'm not letting Chun Li. I'm not letting Chun Li look upset. I don't like. I don't like it when she looks upset. Uh, so I'll just stick with her. I just realise it is where it is. It's just they put the divide in in the map in a different place. It's going super fast as well. Oh, we killed it. Oh. That's annoying. Don't you hit it when you kill again. Oh. I think we got, got too excited for it. And it's got overly... Like, oh no, he beat me. Nah, why you? Spits his dummy out. <laughs> What's my favourite retro fighting game? asks John Walker. I would say probably Street Fighter, but. I haven't played it for such a long while. Oh, I'm playing as Ryu now, that's bad. I didn't mean to do that, never mind. Um, Round one. Because it was quite colourful and cartoony. Whoa. What's he doing to me? What is he? He slaps around the head. Bad cough you've got there, mate. You better go and get a test. Round two. Fight. Or stop smoking. Okay. Knock the fish off. Oh, destruction. Oh. Yeah, you definitely need to sort that cough out there. Right, anyway, so that's the original Street Fighter. It's not Turbo, it's not uh, Alpha, Omega, whatever. I uh, remember a few years ago when um, Dead Rising 3 brought out that add-on and they did a... E, uh, yeah, E3. They did a video of it. Um, and it was like, you know, do this, do that, do the other, and they called it Dead Rising uh, Ultra 2 Omega Alpha, and it just basically took the mickey out of uh, all the Call of Duty games, not Call of Duty games, what was I saying Call of Duty for? Oh, there's Call of Duty down there, that's why. Um, all the uh, Street Fighter games and all their silly add-on names. Right, next up, um, remember I said before um, that I had Rainbow Islands on the uh, Mega Drive? I lent it to someone and I never got it back, Japanese version. Well, for fourteen ninety five, you can own Rainbow Bell Adventures, which is a twin B game. And as far as I'm aware, it never came out of the UK. Although it did, because this is English, so ignore that. However, I don't know anything about these games, so uh, this could be either the best game I've ever played, or a lot of bleep bleep. If it was in a box, it would be super expensive. Help me. Bam, guess what? 
I think we're in space. There was games called Parodius. They were good. I had them on the uh, Super Famicom. I give the Super Famicom away. Press them last time. I'll ever do that. New game. Twin B. Win Boo. Oh, Twin Boo. Win Boo. And Gum Boo. Well, we'll go for Twin Boo. she said all right we're off push start all right so we're collecting bells so for legal reasons they're not coins and they're not rings they are bells All right, okay. All right, okay. Whoa! That's not good. They can go back. Oh, you got me. We got it, we got it. Well done, little guy. The colours are very, um, pastel -y. Music's jolly enough though, isn't it? Oh. So why, why, is the, why do when I hold the jump, why does the bar come up and then start flashing and then nothing happen? Oh no! There's a little fairy there. I've rescued you. Right. So we can go back and try again, can we? Yeah. Right, so we've already got these ones. Right. That blue thing is doing call, isn't it? Let's be honest. Oh, there's a timer going down as well. Oh, no, it's not it's going up. Oh, there's a... It's a tennis ball. What's that going to do? Okay. That's that's the weirdest thing I've ever. Uh... All right, right. If I jump. Oh, go away you. Get a bell. Oh no, oh no, I'm in immortal. What's a fall to my death? Oh good. But I'm not I'm not immortal anymore. Oh Oh Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, I was getting so excited. I've got to show you the game. Right, well, I, I, I feel bad, so I'm going to uh, I'm going to play the game again. Feel bad for you guys. I'm sorry. It is a platform version. There is no, uh... this is why I was doing that now. Please, 
Please save me. I'm a princess who's got caught out. A little tough, by the way. Move that out of the way. I can't see what's going on. Right, we'll go for new game. So we got Sir Twin Boo, Win Boo, and Gwyn Boo. And then this weird thing that was like, huh? Anyway, just press go and then off you go. I'm just excited, that's all. I don't understand what the jump does though. I get what the punch does. Right, so we've got bells. I have played this before, um, but literally just. Set test. Oh, I didn't see that before. the uh, thing. Right, the baseball. It's the weirdest thing ever. Can't pick the baseball. I had baseball moving before. There you go. And it does the weirdest thing I've ever seen on the game. around the... I'm getting more power up. Just spins around the screen, but as the screen moves, it moves. Whoa! Another bell. Do a lot better this time than I did before. Bell, bell, give me the bell. There's the bell. Did we get the bell? Did we get the bell? Did we get the bell? We got the bell. We're getting lots of bells. Oh, I can't reach them because I don't know how to do the jump thing. Right? Alright, there you go. I'm actually enjoying this, I'll be honest. It's like the weirdest shoot em up game ever, but like I said before, for legal reasons, you're not collecting coins. Go through a candy forest. Right, 
bonus. That's a bonus, isn't it? Right. We don't want to go in there yet with the creepy old guy. So let's go and collect these first. What? No! Same level again, am I? Right. It's annoying, wasn't it? Right, speed. Oh, look at them colours! That looks so much nicer! Anyway. You got to see it. Really annoyed. Actually, no, let's, go, let's keep it on. Let's keep it on. Just see. Oh, right, right. Right, so now they go to one player. Will it give me an option for continue? Continue, yeah. And then will it go to. Let's try that one. And we'll go to. There we go, on to the next level. There you go. Looks exactly the same. Oh, Punch is a lot stronger though. Yeah, that'll teach you on it. Mess with me. Oh, you did pal. I'm a spaceship. I went the wrong way, which is, turns out to be the right way. How does that work? I know they all come back. What now? Oh, what have that done? I'll leave that done. I don't think bells at the minute. Going back to the shop, I might keep this one. Anyway, that's definitely enough of that. I apologise for not showing you the game before. Uh, but that was uh, Twin B Rainbow Bell Adventures. And it was actually very good. And then, the old classic is back. Only 10.95. It's one of my favourite games in the system. I put not in any particular order because my mind changes all the time. But I'd say Mario Kart on the SNES, um, F Zero, um, and uh, Super Mario World are like my three favourite games. Although I did have some really good ones. Like I say, I had Parodius. Just good shoot 'em up. Uh, Gradius is a good shoot 'em up. Oh, and I've also now got Super Thunderblade on the SNES, but it'll only work on the Japanese one. Um, basically, Thunder Force, not Thunder Blade, Thunder Force, Thunder Force Four, but so much harder than the Mega Drive version, which I've had for years. <laughs> Again, Japanese. <laughs> so, is it going to work this time? And the answer is, yay! Right, so let's see how well whoever owned this before me has done on this game. I'll go for that one, 92, one player game. It's because I have no friends. 
I have no friends. Do you want to be my friend? Oh, friend. Oh, gaming friend. All right, look where we are. Can we zoom out of the map? No. Just try a random level. I remember uh, the old shop I had. I was playing this game. And, uh, yeah, we'll keep you in there, mate. Oh, you can go away. Well, what part of go away do you not understand? Oh, okay. Oh, dear. Ha, 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 oh. Right, if I drop that there, that kills him. Then I can jump up and get that. There you go. Right, that's when I can get past him. And he's stuck in the hole. Which is now. Ah! Ah! Go away! Ah! Yeah, yeah, yeah. I thought I'd run then. Ah! <laughs> Surrounded by these. Oops. Uh oh. Uh. Right. No! <laughs> or, or a fax tough. Uh, a fax as well. So is this the end of the game? I can't remember. Anyway, as I was saying, I was at the old shop and it was always quiet in the old shop. And someone brought this game in, so I set it up and started playing it from the beginning. And I got to the 10th castle and I was like halfway through it. It took me a couple of days because I was sort of serving people and doing stuff in the meantime. Someone came in and bought it off me. So I've never finished this game. That's the closest I've ever got. Yeah, we're only on six. I'm sure there's 10 castles. So this will be seven then, won't it? It says Bowser. Yeah, I was trapped then, John. It was uh, it was pretty bad, pretty bad. What the hell? Right, is there anywhere I can uh, just kind of get some power ups? fall down, I have to do that. It's like I just run along it and then jump. Ah. So we're all the. Has someone finished this game and now it's come back with all the baddies for you? so disappointing. <laughs> I mean, so if I just fell off, I was just, you know, you're going to do that, you're going to like it, you're not, but you like it, yeah, you will. So we'll leave it there. Um, <laughs> so we got Super Mario World, uh, Twin B, uh, Street Fighter, uh, Syndicate, Mortal Kombat we won't talk about, and Flashback, so which was my favourite out of these. I think I'd have to say Twin B 
was my favourite. I mean, obviously Super Mario's, you know, classic, but I mean, out of the others, out of the other four, yeah, uh, Twin B is my favourite. So it's not quite an hour, but it's near enough. So we'll leave it there. So a huge thanks to everyone who's been chatting away, including some newbies, which is always good to see. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, etc., etc., etc. Uh, that's John Walker, Tufts TV. Um, who else did we have? Uh, Gold Darley Q, MA Iraq, uh, uh, DC number nine, and JT. Uh, thank you very much for what you did. Just, uh, and all being well, I will see you again soon with some more retro gaming or driving or flight simulator. I want to go back on flight simulator. Uh, maybe even later on tonight, depends how I feel. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I'll uh, see you again soon. Thanks, everyone. Uh, be seeing you. Till next time. Annoy the neighbours. <laughs>